All right, folks, we have here a hover round MPV5. This power chair here has one thing that most MPV5 hover round don't have. It has the five inch seat lift. So this one here comes with a seat lift. As you can see right here in the front of the chair, you'll see the motor right here for the seat lift right there. As a matter of fact, if you want the seat to go up on this chair, but before we talk about that, this chair only has 13 hours of runtime. So it's, it's literally brand new, 13 hours of runtime. And if you want to make the seat lift go up, you go to your joystick. There's a button that shows a picture of a seat. You just press it. As soon as you press it, you'll, you'll see two little lights. Then you can use your joystick for up and down. So if I push the joystick forward, you can see the seat lift going up. So right now, you're going to add 5 inches to your 22 inches starting. You'll be at 27 inches here. This chair will not drive with the seat elevated, so you have to bring the chair down because there's a sensor right here. This button has to be pushed down before it can drive again, okay? So this chair has an inhibitor right here to stop the chair from driving. So if I bring the seat back down, you'll see the chair will start driving again. I turn the, and now it's driving again, as you can see. So this is a hover round. The seat on this chair is a large seat. It's about 21 inches wide, 21 wide by 18 deep. It has a safety belt right here. It has flip up arms on both sides. And the arms can go out if you need more width. The Hover Round Corporation is famous for their rounded foot plate, so you can go around a corner without hitting too many things. It does flip up like this when you exit the chair. If you ever want to put this chair in neutral, you want to roll it, you can see it's in gear. You would turn the power off because these are electric motors. There's a motor here, there's a motor here. If you go right here with the handle, you'll see little black knobs. Push them down, one and two, and now you're in neutral, as you can see. No, nothing is holding the chair from going forward. When you're done pushing it up and up, turn your power back on and you're ready to go again. The chair has nine inch air tires here. These are air tires on the front. The back tires are solid tires. These are solid tires back there. There's a knob right here. So this is where you would adjust the arm width as I showed you earlier. This is your turning radius in your house. Come over here, baby. This is what it would look like if you turn in your house. When you charge the batteries on that chair, you'll, you'll, get a char you'll get a charger with the chair and the charger will plug right here, right below here. And as soon as the light turns green on your charger, the charger will stop charging. These are smart chargers. They know when to stop charging. You have two batteries. You can see one here and there's another one on the other side. They're, U, they're U1 batteries. They're, they're standard size batteries. It takes two batteries to run this chair. This chair does have a 300 pound weight capability and it'll run about 15 miles on a battery charge. That 15 miles, that's in perfect condition. If you're outside going fast in the grass, you're not going to get 15 miles, but it's going to run all day long. It's a super nice chair. So this is a hover around MPV5 with the five inch seat lift with the flip up arms, the 21 inch seat by 18 deep with the rounded foot plate. This is a pretty famous power chair. You see them all over the place. It's made by the hover around corporation and it's ready to go. So this is the Hub Around MPV5. Top speed is about five miles an hour. Very easy chair to drive. Now this chair, you will hear the motors. They have a little bit of humming, which is normal because this chair has, I don't know why, but it has very heavy duty motors. These are the motors that they don't make anymore. They're, they last forever. They're heavy duty motors. This chair also has the five inch seat lift, which you can see when you push the button, push it forward, you can see the seat lift going up. On this power chair, when you use the seat lift, you need to be sitting forward uh, because the seat lift is, the, the seat is back on the seat lift, so on the pole. 
So when you're coming down, that's your five inch seat lip. When you're coming down, if you sit forward, that's the best way to make this seat lift work. See how up and down perfectly and you're there. But it will not drive until you turn the seat lift off and now we're back to the races. So this chair has five, this chair has five speeds. So if I put it on the first speed, I just went from five to one. This is the first speed. So this is the first speed. I don't think you'll get in too much trouble at this speed. I don't even know if it turns at that speed. Yeah, it does turn. All right, so at the first speed, it's not fast enough. I'm, I'm gonna put it back to five. Whoop, two, three, four, five. And this chair picks up speed as you drive. So if you hold this joystick forward, you'll see it's, it takes off as, it's, as you start rolling. This chair shouldn't have any problem in the grass because it has really super heavy duty motors. Plus you have nice wide wheels. They're about four inches wide, these drive tires. It's not how tall the tires are when you're in the grass, it's how wide they are. Okay, a lot of people say, I want to have tall tires to go in the grass. No, it's like a bicycle with tall tires. It's not going to help you in the grass. It's the width of the tire that makes you go through the grass. So this is the MPV5 with the rounded foot plate. And I forgot how many miles this one had. I think it only had 18 hours or something like that. 13 hours, okay, my cameraman just told me, 13 hours, so it's literally brand new. Uh, the only thing I noticed about this chair, it's got a little bit of yellowish, just from sitting in someone's home, just, it, they do turn yellow, this plastic, but you can't hardly tell. It's not because it was used, it's just because it, when it sits next to a window and the sun hits it, it the color will change on the, this is supposed to be all gray, so it's a little, anyway, make a long story short, no big deal, ready to go. Hi, I'm Mark. And my name is Alex. We're co-owners of Mark's Mobility. I started this company in 1995. We sell many products, not just what you see in this video. If you have any questions or concerns, please call us at the number below at 800-677-6293. Thank you and have a wonderful day.